Cheers, everybody. Welcome back to another bespoke beer review for the beer connoisseur out there. And in this one, we're off to Brew York and we have a can of their The Peach Mode. Super smashing great boys and girls. Peaches and cream pale coming in at 6% ABV. There you go. There's the back side, which I shall read to you. I've got to sing. I've got to sing this. Well, a little bit of singing. It says, All I ever wanted, all I ever needed here in this can. Does that sound right? Peaches and cream. <laughs> That's what it says there. Peaches and cream are legendary. They can only bring you calm. Kick back, enjoy the silence. And revel in this, revel, 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 not revel, revel in this peaches and cream pale finished with vanilla and our ever favourite unusual tonka. Hops are CTZ T90 beer in, malts are pale, malted oats, flaked oats, malted wheat, crystal 150, acidulated malt. It's got a peaches rating of five peaches out of five. So there you go. There you go. Peaches rating five out of five. Let's crack this open. Right, you do. See what it's all about. Yeah, you do get a hint of peach in there. Definitely. It smells rather sweet. Give them that. Definitely get some peach in there. Tin peaches, maybe. So let's whack it in and see what it's all about. No doubt there'll be loads of peaches and stuff. Um, Depeche, Depeche Mode. Did I ever really like Depeche Mode? I, I, never, I didn't mind them, to be honest, when I was growing up. Um, they're all right. I remember them appearing on top of the pops. And of course... For me, it looked weird when the conventional band, if you see the con a conventional band on top of the pops back in the 80s, they were either kind of like dancers or a band, what looked like a band, but this lot turned up on top of the pops and one of them was playing a bicycle wheel with a with a stick. And I thought, oh, you lot were a bit weird, didn't you? <laughs> anyway, <laughs> let's get back into it. As you can see, look at that. Very juicy looking, no head there. Absolutely, guy does look like kind of like apple juice in a way. Um, and again, you get peach, but you do get something like a, a sweet eggnog characteristic in that as well. Like a sweetness there. It does feel that way. Anyway, I'm going to go in, so cheers everybody. Peaches and cream, eh? You get a lot of peach and cream in that. Um, more peaches and cream, to be honest. It's very, very sweet. Very sweet. And you do get um, peach. It does feel like juice. I'm trying to look for any beery characteristics there. It does feel um, like juice. It really does. Um, there is more of a bitter edge coming out as you drink it. I'm picking that up. But it is, you know, rather pleasant. You don't get any inkling of the strength in this whatsoever. So it is full on peach. Not so much of the cream, but it is full on peach. Yeah, you know, it brings a smile to the face, put it that way. It's um, 
definitely one of them beers what make me smile because it is is kind of like a you see it's a novelty beer if you want but it is rather pleasant i have to say um so I, would i buy it again maybe not because i think i'll buy other brew york beers to try out uh, but it is very sweet like i said but it's fun it's pleasant boys and girls the peach mode give it a go <laughs> give it a go thank you very much for watching this one see all of you on my next one cheers <laughs>